Good morning, everyone. I am Anand Selva Kesri, Selva and Short, and I'm responsible for personal banking and wealth management. I've been at Citi for over 30 years, mostly in consumer banking and wealth management. I spent the first 27 years building our business across Asia and EMEA. I've lived and worked in many markets, including India, Singapore, China, and Taiwan. I've been here in the US for the last three years, most recently leading our US consumer banking business. Over the course of my career, I've witnessed firsthand the digital disruption and rapid evolution of personal banking. I'm really looking forward to leveraging my learnings to position our business well as these trends play out in the US and globally. Consumer banking and wealth management looks very different today than it did just three years ago. Advances in technology and the pandemic have changed consumer behavior. They're increasingly seeking seamless and highly personalized digital experiences and are demanding choices and flexibility in how they bank, pay, and borrow, and shifting demographics across the wealth continuum and the intergenerational transfer of wealth have increased demand for new digital capabilities along with trusted advice and more diverse teams of advisors to manage wealth. In personal banking and wealth management, we are focusing our strategy and our investments to stay close to these trends. We offer a comprehensive range of financial solutions, from credit cards and checking accounts, to investments and capital market solutions, leveraging the power of the entire city franchise. And all of this sits on a foundation of award-winning digital experiences. I'm confident that our newly refocused US personal banking and wealth management business will play an important role in Citi's ability to drive shareholder value. Earlier, Jane spoke about the importance of shifting our business mix so that we'd have both growth and scale businesses with strong competitive positioning. She also spoke about the importance of our businesses having clear synergies with the broader Citi franchise. With the strategic actions we've announced last year, PBWM now consists of two core businesses, US personal banking and global wealth management that fit squarely into these criteria. US personal banking includes branded cards, retail services, and retail banking, and serves our home market, which has the largest consumer wallet in the world. Personal banking contributes two thirds of PBWM revenue. Global wealth management is a fast growing market where we are bringing together the full power of city to serve the entire continuum of wealth clients from affluent to ultra high net worth. Global wealth management contributes the remaining one third of PBWM revenue. In PBWM, we serve 75 million clients with around $940 billion in client assets across the two core businesses, generating $23 billion in revenue and 13% ROTCE, excluding the impact of credit reserve releases. Our ambitions for both businesses are built on strong existing foundations and the connections between the two. Our global wealth management business includes our top five global private bank, and we're already the top three firm in wealth management in Asia. Over the last five years, global wealth management delivered 20% ROTCE. Our wealth business benefits significantly from leveraging the products, platforms, digital capabilities, and client relationships we already have across both the US personal banking and institutional businesses. As we scale the wealth business, it is clear that we are one of the very few firms that offer such a comprehensive range of wealth solutions to a wide spectrum of clients on a global scale. In US personal banking, we are the number two issuer of credit cards with a broad portfolio of proprietary co-brand and private label cards. Growth in this business is centered in payments and lending, with our cards business generating close to 85% of our revenues. 
Our go forward plan is to continue to strengthen our leadership in cards while establishing a full continuum of lending solutions. Our retail banking is a top 10 deposit franchise in the US with well established presence in six affluent urban centers and strong digital capabilities. We have a targeted strategy to maximize value from our retail bank and to fuel our growth plans in both wealth management and payments and lending. Over the last five years, US personal banking delivered 12% ROTC despite the headwinds from COVID and lower rates. And within US personal banking, our cards business delivered 17% returns. With that introduction, I'm now going to turn it over to our head of global wealth management, Jim O'Donnell, to tell you more about our plans for the wealth business. Then I'll come back and go into more detail with US personal banking and then tie it all together. Over to you, Jim.